during the last 15 years, we have seen NCDs rise drastically in low resource settings. In Africa alone, NCDs are rising by almost 30 percent, and we know that by 2030, NCDs are likely to overtake communicable diseases. The main challenge is the silo approach to healthcare, where everybody deals with a small piece instead of looking at healthcare as a total system. So the conversation on Blueprint was to ask, what is the holistic approach to addressing the challenge of rising NCDs? Globally, almost half the world's population has limited access to health. UHC 2030 is a goal that every country, every individual, will have access to health by the year 2030. The Blueprint is a framework for non-communicable disease care, and this brings together various partners in order to implement this. The Blueprint is not a one company, one government, one individual approach. It's a multi-stakeholder approach. We are looking at pharma companies, for example, who may address supply chain or commodity security for hypertension, for diabetes, for cancer. Non-traditional partners, like telecommunications, and transport industry. We are looking at bringing in governments, either local or national, as key partners in the blueprint to ensure that everyone everywhere, irrespective of their ability to afford, has a chance at life. The blueprint approach looks at removing the barriers that stop people from accessing care for non-communicable diseases. It means looking at the entire journey early screening, early diagnosis, awareness, referral to treatment, and long-term care. This is really what is really transformational. The strength of the Blueprint project is that we can get patients from the grassroots because the community healthcare volunteers go out into the home states to be able to identify these patients and navigate them to the various facilities where they can get assistance. So we are seeing a lot more early diagnosis and with that then we are able to institute care with a curative intent. Tabida. Seeing young mothers getting good treatment and getting cured is so important because she ensures that she provides the best future that she can for her children as well. The most rewarding is seeing a patient come in hopeless and despair, seeing them through their treatment and um, seeing them get better and get well and telling them that they're in remission. Initially, Takeda supported the coming together of the stakeholders within this consortium. Now we are leveraging other funding partners to be involved as well. The Blueprint is saving lives. That's the greatest thing you'll see. It's a strong proof that uh, this blueprint really works. Mm -hmm.